Welcome to a very short mod for the border to High Rock, I think. For the border of High Rock, Skyrim border discovered. Heard they were forming the Dawn Guard, vampire hunters. Or That's old news. That's really old news, actually. Stop! This is the border of Skyrim and falls under the laws of solitude. You cannot pause and are requested to leave. I only say this once. I am leaving. Very wise. <laughs> Halt! Introduce yourself. Who are you? I'm a passenger. Let me take a good look at you. All right. Welcome to High Rock, passenger. Obey our laws, and you'll be fine. I'd be a lot warmer and a lot happier with a belly full of Hold. meat. Why is he naked? Who are you? How can I assist you? What the? What? Never seen a nudist? But, but I prefer to keep my face not exposed to the sun. And don't look at me like that. Okay, the, the drunken horse. Oh God. How can I assist? Hmm? Good day. How's business? It goes well. Yeah, that does not trade with the Britons, but also with the Nords in Halfstadt, on the island up north. You want to buy something? Nope. Red. Hmm? Good day. I must say it's beautiful here. Yes, it is. Did you know there might be old mines in it in the mountains? Uh, from the times that the Nords lived here until 20, 30 years ago. That's good to hear. How about the innkeeper? Is he... Is he drinking from his hand? Stender. Need something? I... Uh, I saw you pouring mead. Without a tankard. Are my eyes deceiving me? I have a tankard. But you won't see it because it's invisible. I am a magician. Oh. You must be a powerful mage then. If you can drink from invisible tankards. Yes. Well... You seem like an adventurer. I, I made a big, big mistake and I need help. I'm not afraid to draw a weapon. Listen. Under this inn, there are ruins of an ancient castle. First, I thought these noises I heard were from rats or some other small mammal. I was curious. Customers, I went downstairs to take a look. What a stupid mistake. Go on. They took Alina away. <laughs> These green, evil, small creatures. I have, I have never seen them before. I could not stop them from taking Alina away from me. Green creatures. Seems like a lot of trouble. I'll help you. Thank you. Thank you. Now if you order a bed to sleep on, I will bring you to the trapdoor under your bed. If you go downstairs, you will meet the dogs. Good luck. Thanks, I guess. A touch of oblivion. Rescue Alina. She's probably down here. Cellar of the Damned. Water. The hell? Elena? You think you can rescue a lady in distress? I am not what I seem to be. We have met each other, didn't we? In that house. In Markov. Molek Bao? It's me. Well, 
not in person, of course. Oh my, oh my, this is jackpot. I have Dragonborn to play with, this is fun. I cannot go back. Of course not. I have arranged that. And now you're thinking. I am trapped and how can I go back? Hmm. Do you have a clue, Dragonborn? Oh, I have an idea. Why don't you just kill Helena? Oh, oh no, that's not really nice, isn't it? That poor, beautiful lady, she, she should be helping the customers. This... This is disgusting. Really? Well, but after that you'll be free. How's that? She dead? You free? She will be dead anyway, only... You'll do the killing. Um. So, Dragonborn, what are you going to do? <sighs> He's not going to be happy. Need something. It's safe. The only noises you hear, you hear at the night, are from rats and other mammal. Thank you. And the liner? Is she... Is she... She was dead. I was too late. I'm sorry. This is... Death. Bless her soul. I, I'll contact her family about her death. Here's your reward. Thank you. Thank you. At least you saved my life. Oh, I'm such a liar. Liar, liar, pants on fire. Which there were multiple times down there. Hmm? Pine Vale needs a hero. What? Return to Uther, the innkeeper in Pine Vale. What's Pine Vale? Yeah, this is the inn. And so it is Pine Vale. What do you want? Are you alright? Alright. My glory days are over. I used to be loved by a woman and had many fans, but these days are all over. Which days are over, poor fellow? You don't recognize me? I was a member of the Herman's Hemorrhoids. And we played high rock. Yeah, baby, trash, search and destroy. Um, okay then, I never heard of you. Who don't you talk to? See somewhere up? Oh, He's sleeping? Of course he is. What of course he is. I found Yorith. He is dead, killed by a frost troll. What? Dead? He is... Oh, uh, and I said such bad things about him that he had to move out of Pineville. I have the key to his house. I have the key to his house. Oh, I'm such a horrible person. I talk bad about him and now he's dead. I have no heart. <laughs> he's killed by a frost troll. You're not to blame. You are right. Anyway, since he's dead and has no relatives, why don't you live here in Pineville? This village needs a hero. You are welcome. No thank you. Bookstore. Hmm? How's business? Nobody's buying books anymore. We're living in different times. Why? Because of the internet, you fool. Everybody reads books online. On computers, mobile phones. Uh, why wasting my time? You don't understand. I don't know what this internet you speak of as friend, but I don't want to know. Almost sure. Almost sure. Half stead. Finally to sure, actually. Need something? How's business? Good, actually. We Britons give the pearls and wood. They give us fish and clams. It's good doing business here. Plus, they give me a place to sleep. Sounds lucrative. Yes, and after a good deal, we'll seal it with a toast. Okay then. What's this? 
Lemonade. Wait, what? It's like Rejector's Mead. You must be very staying like this all the time. <laughs> you think so, but that's not true. I'm working very hard. Really? When you're not looking, I do some push-ups, run across this island, dive a few times and have a good conversation with the old man's story. It's true. Hmm? Where's your sense of humor? Listen. This is a true story. Alright. A crazy nutter jumped in the air. You know what happened? He missed. <laughs> oh my, so funny. I'm dying. I'm dying. Hi. Are you really a pirate? Oh yeah! I sailed the seven seas when I was just a little kid. My dad took me with him. Are you a pirate? Yes, I'm also a pirate. Look at my muscles. Oh yeah! I am glad I meet another pirate. Here, let's drink to that. This is a nice place. Hi, passenger. I'm Captain One Eye because I have a one eye. See? Yes, I see. Like I said, it's a nice place. Yes, but we have a problem. I just talked with my friend here. There is a bandit ship west of Halfstadt, which needs to be cleared out. I can do that for you, but it's not free. Really? I need my men here for fishing and trading, but if you do that for me, I'll reward you with 300 gold. Good luck, my friend. Okay. I just need to clear off that ship. Sounds easy enough. Yes. You are busy? We are in good terms with the kings of High Rock, but you never know if there will be a war, since this island used to be a part of High Rock. Used to be? Yeah, look, I don't know much about history, but I do know much about how to stop an enemy. But you seem alright. Thanks, I guess. Need something? Old man Snowy. See, he snore a lot. Hello, can I have a herring, please? Sure! Here you are! That's one gold, please! Thank you! So do you like half stud? I thought it was High Rock. Ah, yes! Both Britons and Nords claim this island. Since the war of Bendermark, we used to have a large parts of High Rock. But we lost all of it since their miracle of peace. But not this island. And since we trade with them, the Britons don't bother us anymore. So Halfstead is part of Skyrim now? Long, long time ago, this island was inhabited by Nords. Anyway, the Britons make a good profit on trading with us. It's better this way. What's on that ship anyway? Oh, skeletons as far as I can see. Guardians. Take that guardian. Halo 5 guardians. Halo 5 guardians. It is then. <laughs> Tyrus, where the hell are you? You look like you want to die. So I must kill you now. Now and forever. And he's dead. I cleared out that ship for you. Aye, not only for me, but for Halfstad. With that ship cleared out, our trade with the Nords and the Bretons will not be frustrated. Here's your reward. Yay, money. Good day. I'm so freaking rich. Okay, well, I guess that was some um, Halfstad. And I forgot to say goodbye from Beyond Reach, so goodbye for Beyond Reach and for Halfstead. I don't know which mod we'll do later, but I think it's going to be a good one. So stay tuned. Thanks for watching. Peace.